We believe in open innovation, in people's inventiveness, and in the crowd as a source of new impulses to shape the future. We thus share our challenge with you. Please share your ideas with us. Let us create sustainable solutions together. With these words, Mark Roberts made the invitation to participate in the K plus S Brian Challenge in September 2018. Scientists, institutes, and private individuals were called upon to find solutions with which the saline wastewater from the tailings pipes could be minimized. The response was excellent. More than 40 ideas from a total of 16 different countries were received by the crowdsourcing platform Nine Sigma. A jury of external and K plus S internal experts has now awarded the two best proposals. And the winners are Kevin Joback from the USA and Thomas Baumgartel from Australia. Congratulations to the two winners of the K plus S Brine Challenge. You should be very proud of yourselves. We had more than 40 submissions from around the globe and your two were chosen as the winners based on a set of very rigorous criteria. Hello, my name is Kevin Joback. I'm a chemical engineer and work for Molecular Knowledge Systems. I feel very happy and honored that I've won the K plus S Brine Challenge. Mr. Jobeck's idea was to uh, involve a water storing polymer that can store rainfall water and release it back into the air afterwards. And um, this can be combined with different systems and that's what we're planning to do. Yeah, I feel very humbled uh, and very proud at the same time um, that uh, I was chosen as the winner um, because I'd, for that specific challenge, I believe, um, and I was quite hopeful that I was presenting an idea which was very attractive uh, to KNS. Mr. Baumgartel proposed an idea where you um, create a water repellent surface on the salt tailings and then cover it with a second material so you can cope with water during heavy rainfalls. Innovation, from my perspective, is a very important enabler for our corporate strategy. We want to thrive for operation excellence, but at the same point in time, we want to create step-changing products and services for the ever-changing needs of the markets. I strongly believe that the K plus S Brine Challenge was a success for two different reasons. First, we wanted to find the best possible solution for our tailings piles challenge. Secondly, we wanted to learn how to leverage the wisdom of the crowd for our open innovation efforts. Since we made great progress on both ends, I'm very happy with the outcome. Well, unfortunately, we didn't really get in a completely new technology for covering tailings piles. But at the end, we got two really great approaches that could actually help improve our systems. And that's what we're trying to do in the next steps, figuring out if they can actually work and if they can improve the systems that we already have. We will try to establish uh, scientific experiments to prove that these systems can actually work and then we will test it. And that's something that we would like to do together with our winners. I would also like to thank all of the participants who submitted ideas. The participation rate exceeded even our expectations. Your ideas contributed to the first very successful crowdsourcing challenge at K plus S, and we believe that this is only the beginning. Because we at K plus S are committed to innovation, and we believe that open source innovation is one way in which we can accomplish that goal. So stay tuned, there will be more coming. And thanks again. <laughs>